Do you think that this uh, leader actually has a mandate to govern, by the way? You know, what do you think? There's been this campaign uh, to get Boris added to the ballot paper. It's all about oh, 10,000. Is that about 10,000 uh, signatures to that? Joe says, oh, for goodness sake. What do you think to that? Boris being on the ballot paper, nonsensical or what, what? I don't think Boris can be on the ballot paper now in that way. I do think, if I just give me one second on this, I do think that the Conservative MPs have made a mistake in thinking that Boris is the sort of political figure who just vanishes like Mrs May vanishes. You know, we don't see her again except sitting there with her arms crossed. Um, or even John Major or someone like that. Boris is a huge political figure. And I I even Boris untethered, you know, just wandering around, is, is going to be a pole of attraction away or from the conservative or distraction away from the conservative party and the government even if he's not trying to be for quite some years there's to come there's a wonderful article in the times today written by william haig which says you know prepare for the, the enormous sulk because uh, boris johnson but even was, if boris did nothing he'd be he'd still be yes, out but, there as this but you always he has that. this latent You've got political this divisive power. thing and actually if he had any credibility and any dignity, which he clearly doesn't... No, he has great credibility and dignity, and I stuck with him well, right to I the end. Did, but, but I don't think you need to make gratuitous well, comments I, like that to make your point. But I think he would actually say to the 10,000 people who have signed a petition, I've gone, that decision's been made... We need a united party. So that would be a dignified response. But I well, I, don't, I think he has said today that he doesn't support this. I think that decision is going to cost the Tories. Um, I'm fascinated. I mean, a lot can happen, let's be clear, right? A lot can happen in two years or whatever it was we've just been two calculating. Two years is a lifetime. Yeah, it is in politics. So a lot can happen. But I, uh, if there was an election tomorrow, a general election tomorrow, I think that the Tories would be deeply impacted by the decision to oust Boris Johnson. Uh, it's almost like a coup, I regarded it. And I think that would impact the Tories.